everyone, Courtney here. So today I'm going to be doing a review on the Fault in Our Stars movie, even though this is like a month out of date from when I've seen it. Anyway, I hope you enjoy. So to start off with, the Fault in Our Stars was predicted to be disappointing for me, specifically because when they announced the cast, I'd already read the book by John Green and I was disappointed in the cast chosen however that completely changed my mind and as soon as I started seeing the previews for it it was it was really amazing so if you haven't read the book or seen the movie the plot line is Hazel Grace Lancaster she has cancer she's had it since she was a child and it's about her story and how she copes with it and her mum kind of tells her to go to this support group it'll help get things off her chest and just to really help her out and that's when she meets Augustus Waters and slowly falls in love with him and it's kind of a romantic film mixed with very sad emotions and there is no doubt that in this film whether you watch it at home or in the cinema I don't even know if it's out in the cinema but if it is you're gonna cry no matter what but it has some really funny bits in it too she falls in love and she has a wish to have a book that she really loves it ends in a cliffhanger and she really wants to know what happened next so without spoiling too much it goes on a journey on how she can find out the ending towards the end it's a plot twist but if you read the book then you're going to understand what happens so like i said it is a very sad movie but thanks to nat wolf who portrays isaac he makes it really comical and funny and some of the things he comes out with is just pure genius i just love him so much he just makes everything so much more light-hearted and the way he's blind and he's still has his jokes. Shailene Woodley portrays or acts as Hazel Grace and she does an amazing job. Hansel Elgort, I was, I completely pictured a different Augustus Waters in my head but after the film you can't help but love him and fall in love with him. But the negative things are that they did cut a lot of the main quotations and phrases in the film which slightly did annoy me seeing as in a specific scene I would be like oh my god he's gonna say this and he wouldn't say it and you're like oh because that was quite a key term or phrase used in the book. Another thing is the cast they've cut out, they cut out Gus's ex-girlfriend but overall I would definitely recommend this film to anyone and I would definitely give it 5 out of 5 stars and yeah you can also use the discount called 20 to get 20% off your order all the things will be in the description below. I'm always welcome to constructive criticism. You can leave constructive criticism in the comments below or you can just tell me what you thought of the movie. So yeah, I hopefully see you soon and bye.